Hey, it's Matt. Today, let's talk about RV jack pads. You know, in the past, uh, under my stabilizer jacks and under my, my power jacks, I've, I've used the, the venerable old 2x6. And I always carry a few 2x6s because you never know what you might need them for. But for jack pads, uh, you know, leveling jacks or stabilizer jacks, these aren't the, the greatest things in the world because if you, if you get in a situation where you need more height and you need to stack multiple two by sixes on top of each other, sometimes they can slip and that's not good at all. Uh, but it's good to have two by sixes around. Uh, another thing that you could use is our old favorite, the little the little Camco Lego blocks, you know, the leveling blocks. And you can, you can, use these under the pads but the problem is these are plastic now, i know they're pretty strong plastic but these are made to be more of leveling blocks not jack pads you know you, you you stack them up on each other and put the rv tires on top of it to give you some more height to actually level out your rv rather than using these for the jack pads so today we're going to do a fun project out of some leftover wood uh and we're gonna make some some really heavy duty rv jack pads uh i'm gonna use four by fours and pressure treated plywood but you could easily go down and use two by fours if you don't need the height of four by fours or if you want a bigger one you could go to two by sixes but man those suckers are going to be heavy so let's get into this the first thing we need to do is we need to get some wood measure it up and cut it so let's get going Okay, so now we have four pieces of 4x4, four 14 inches long. And we have two pieces of 3 quarter inch plywood, 14 by 14. Okay, so here's how they're going to go together. We're just going to start laying these to kind of dry fit it. All right. We're going to get these just about as even as we can okay all right that's gonna fit really good I'm a perfectionist that's gonna fit really good on the plywood here all right we're just dry fitting at this point all right all right that's this is how it's gonna go that's how our finished product's gonna look. But now, we need to glue this top part down and screw it down. Thank you. 
All right, there's all the screws. This thing's solid as a rock. Now we're just gonna flip it over and do the same thing on the other side. Okay, so here's the finished product, 14 by 14. Uh, and the reason why I made them 14 inches is because I have a nine inch round pad on my jacks. Uh, and these things, you know, are glued and they're screwed, three screws in, in every four by four. And it's glued with some of that Gorilla Glue. What I did was, I added a handle so that I could pick it up and move it pretty easily because they're, they're kind of heavy. It's not really prohibitive, but this is a great jack pad. This is going to last a lifetime. It's made out of all pressure treated wood. The water's not going to make any difference to it. The rain, wind, snow, sleet, hail, anything. This is going to give me enough height that I, that I need for some uneven terrain. And I think these are really going to last for a lifetime. Uh, and I, I built four of these. This is just one of them. Uh, and you're going to see it in action pretty soon. So uh, let's go back up to the workbench and wrap this up. Okay, there you have it. Some quick and easy DIY RV jack pads. A couple of hand tools, some screws, and some glue, and some leftover wood, and you got something that's virtually indestructible and gonna last a lifetime. I built these with four by fours. If you don't need that much height, you can duplicate this with two by fours, or if you want a bigger one, you could go up to two by sixes, but man, those things are gonna be heavy if you use two by sixes. I used four by fours because I wanted just a little bit more height because you know you, you might go to an uneven campsite and you might need that height for your jack pads or your levelers. Okay, DIY jack pads, let me know what you think below. Please like, comment, subscribe. I answer all comments. And there's gonna be some big announcements coming this week. Uh, I'm actually gonna set a timeline. We're gonna go full time. I'll give you an update on what's been happening. Uh, and and it's, it's starting to get exciting. So here's my video on how to make some easy DIY RV jack pads. This is Matt from RV Travel TV, and I will see you on the road.